Hello everyone and welcome to another awesome Heyday video. My name is Jennifer and here on YouTube I go by Gizmo Spike. In this video I would like to talk some more about baby farms and explain exactly how to make a new farm and how you can have multiple farms on one device. I did make a video about a year and a half ago on this subject but I've been getting a lot of questions about how to make a new farm recently and Supercell ID got a pretty big update since my last video. So I thought now would be a good time for an updated tutorial video on Supercell ID and more specifically, how exactly to start a new farm or multiple new farms and how to have them all on one device. Step one, first things first, and I cannot stress how important this first step is. Before making a new farm, AKA baby farm, it is extremely important to make sure that your main farm is connected to Supercell ID. To check for this, all you have to do is open up the settings menu via the cog wheel on the upper left hand section of your game. If you are connected to Supercell ID, it will have a check mark and will say connected and you can proceed to step two of this tutorial. If you are not connected, then it will say log in. Just click on log in and you'll be presented with this screen. If you have never connected your farm to Supercell ID before, then you will need to register. In order to register, you need to have a valid email address. Click on register now and then continue. On this screen, you will enter in your email address. your email address again, and click on register. Once you click on register, an email will be sent to your account. So make sure you are using an email address that belongs to you and that you have access to. Enter in the code and hit submit. And now your main account is connected to Supercell ID. Connecting your farm to Supercell ID ensures that you can never lose your farm that you have worked so hard on. It also means you can easily add your farm to a new device by just logging in with your already registered email. Now that you have made sure that your main farm is connected to Supercell ID, it's time to make a brand new baby farm. From your main farm, click again on the cog wheel in the upper left hand corner of your game. Now, click on the button that says Connected. This will present you with a Supercell ID screen. Click on Settings and click on Log Out. Don't worry, you're not going to lose your game. Any progress will be saved from what you've already done. As you can see what it says on the screen here, you're about to log out. Game progress will be saved. Hit Confirm. You will now have this screen here where you can choose to either log in with a Supercell ID or play without Supercell ID. If you wanted to log into a farm that you already had, you would click on Log In with Supercell ID. But if you want to start a brand new baby farm, then click on Play Without Supercell ID. This will open up a brand new level one farm. Say OK to the terms of service and the privacy policy. You'll have to watch Mr. Wickers explain how to harvest wheat, but right after that, you can register your new farm to Supercell ID. Just click on sign in on the upper left hand of your screen and then the cog wheel. Log in, register slash log in with another account, register now and continue. You must use a different email for every farm. If you don't have another email, you can make one for free via Gmail, Yahoo, etc. Enter in your email twice and hit register. Retrieve the code from your email. and hit submit, then OK. And voila, 
you now have a brand new farm that is connected to Supercell ID. Step three, switching between your farms. Switching between your farms is super easy now with a fast switch option that was added when Supercell ID was updated last year. In order to switch quickly and easily between farms, just click on the cogwheel and then the circular arrows. You will then be presented with a list of all of your farms. Just click on the email address of the farm that you want to go to and you will be instantly transported to that farm. Want to go back to the farm you just came from? Just click on the cogwheel again, the circle arrows, and the email address of that farm. And that's it. Step four, enjoy heyday and your brand new baby farm. I hope this tutorial was easy and simple to follow and that it helped you to start a brand new baby farm. Please let me know in the comments below if this video was helpful. And if it was, please remember to hit that beautiful red subscribe button so you don't miss out on more helpful and fun videos in the future. Thanks so much for watching. Happy farming. Weeding is life. Peace. Is Hey, it's hey day, it's hey.